properly. Okay. I hope we've gotten a good angle. Hi guys. Mm. I'm filming this video from my son's hospital bed. We've been here for five days. Today is the fifth day. And we're hoping to live soon. Yeah. So I'm saying I'm making this video to um, educate you guys about certain things that we do ignorantly. Yeah. So on Sunday I'd gone for fellowship with my sisters in church. Um, and then my phone was on silent and my husband had been calling to say it was ill but I didn't take the call I didn't even know it was ringing because my phone was on silent and then I got home and I saw my son <laughs> he was weak he had been vomiting and stooling for a while now we quickly took him to the hospital so when we got here the doctor just checked and said oh okay maybe he has had uh, a bit of food poisoning because um in church we are, we celebrated children's day a day ahead of the day like sunday monday was children's day then we had a bit of celebration on sunday and usually for me, I take biscuits and juice with him every time. So I don't want him forcing and water as well. So I just give him the juice and biscuits. Now, celebration, they give them cake, juice again, and rice, cheddar fries, which is really nice, by the way. <laughs> my brethren, so I'm telling you. Later in the day again, my husband took him to Sizzler's for children's day celebration party so just he had taken ribena capri sun cake jello fries norio's biscuits and then i don't know what he had again <laughs> see let me not just bore you with all the details but guys please Stay away from these things. They are bad for your kids. They are very, very, very bad for your kids. See, I saw my son's life. Like, it was flashing in my eyes like this. Oh, my face was shaking. I started having images in my head that, oh God, my son is going to die. My son is going to die guys no kidding no kidding i kid you not see sample said oh you've been in the hospital for how many days for stooling and vomiting it's not ordinary stooling and vomiting no this child got so weak you know he was losing fluids and then he wasn't eating even the drips was as if but a series of tests they did and then we found out that I had um, contacted rotavirus and rotavirus you can check that out on google rotavirus is the symptoms of diarrhea and vomiting and all and then as we all know drugs don't touch viruses it's said to go on its own I'm just here filming this video to tell you that is watching. See me now, looking so unkept. I've not had good sleep, I've not had a proper bath. Ugh. Thankful that my son, yesterday his pulse was so, 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 it was low at some point. It got so fast at another point. They said because he's been stooling and vomiting too much. I'm just thankful. I'm thankful for the fact that my circle is my circle is tight. Like you girls are amazing. You know, I just it was just one call and they set me in track. Cause this gave fear beyond the cut my heart. You know, I was so scared. And I called my pastor Shane. 
she's my best friend in my head <laughs> i called her and all she did was say prudence no 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 you cannot be scared you know Aaron has been healed already before it got to this point so it's just for you to just claim your healing you got it already you know and they prayed with me over the phone just imagine we had almost 30 minutes on the phone prayers 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 and then you know it was great so guys please i beg you i beg you guys do your best to give your kids natural natural things as possible as natural as possible if you need to indulge them on this on natural things let it let it just be for you know let it be something that's occasional not every day my son's school actually don't let them take um, fruits um, juice more than twice a week but when he comes home sometimes I'll just give it to him. I beg, don't disturb me. Take juice and calm down. I beg, don't disturb me. Take biscuit down. In my mind, that is love. Oh, I know how to raise a kid. See where we have landed. Hmm? If not for God that, that just sat on the throne and just said, This girl, let me show you mercy. It's not the story that me and you are here talking. Maybe I'll be here filming and telling you, Oh, yeah, my son. Oh, I lost my son. Oh. I'm thankful. Yeah. Thank God that I didn't lose my son. Thank God he's better. Guys, please take this seriously, okay? Thank you. See you in my next video.